Welcome back, everybody, to the Planet Film Network. So today I am giving you my quick, very quick, out-of-the-theater reaction. Just went and saw Spider-Man Across the Spider-Verse. Everything that everybody is saying from these critic screenings I think is absolutely correct. I don't know if I'm ready to say that it's immediately better than the first movie, just because I think it's doing two very different things. This is a part one, and it is very much a part one, so know that going into it. I think it absolutely executes on being a part one very, very well while also giving you a full-fledged movie. Haley Steinfeld as Gwen Stacy is very much the co-lead of this film and handles it very, very well. I was really, really happy with what they did with her character, how much she had to do. I was also very happy with all the Easter eggs, the references, everything like that as well. Um, and I'm expecting even more in the second part uh, to be the finale to this trilogy. Um, but that being said, Miles Morales is the heart and soul of this movie. I think he is, again fleshed out fantastically, does a really, really great job. Shamik Moore uh, as Miles is fantastic. A lot, a lot for him to do in here. Some various different things, some gears we haven't seen him do, both as an actor and Miles the character. So I think really, really firing on all cylinders. And also the overall plot, Oscar Isaac, Jake Johnson, uh, Andy Sandberg, Jason Schwartzman, I think everybody was doing a fantastic job. So huge huge thumbs up but tj and i will be going into a full spoiler discussion either this weekend or at the very least on tuesday's live show uh so join us there let me know what you thought of the movie in the comments down below and we'll catch you in the next video